Welcome back to the latest edition of Muhlenberg College Plays of the Week. We begin at number 10 with the three goals scored by the Muhlenberg men's soccer team to put away its 4-0 win against William Patterson. In the 54th minute, sophomore Noah Pitala scores his first goal of the season. In the 67th minute, it's junior Andrew Gaines with his first goal of the season. And to close out the scoring in the 89th minute, junior Luke Feeney with his first goal of the season. At number 9, it was Esme Oler on a roller. She recorded 26 kills as the Mule Volleyball team swept a tri-match from Merchant Marine and Vassar. She had a career-high 14 kills in the Vassar match. At number 8, field hockey at Eastern. Sophomore Erin Jackson will make this great run through the circle and pass along the end line to senior Caitlin Henley, who finishes for her first career goal. 27 from 2. At number 7, football leading Dickinson, 10-7 in the second quarter, fourth down, and it's Joe Rapetti passing to junior Aaron Daniels for the 22-yard touchdown, Daniels' first career touchdown. At number 6, junior Alyssa Favel was all over the court in the Mules' tri-match sweep against Merchant Marine and Vassar, 53 digs in the two matches, tying a career high with 28 against Vassar. At number 5, back to field hockey against Eastern, and its freshman Abba Diglio scoring the tying and go-ahead goals in a span of 4 minutes and 37 seconds, becoming the first mule since 1991 to score three goals in the first three games of her career. At number 4 are four of the six sacks recorded by the football team in its win against Dickinson, holding the Red Devils to 194 total yards, Seen here are sacks by Owen Dodona, Quentin Ogren, Isaiah Labello, and Andrew Franklin, who had by far the best sack celebration. Mayona. At number three, the Muhlenberg women's soccer team scored its first goal of the season and got its first win of the season, one to nothing at Catholic on Saturday. The goal was scored by Bree Asbury off a pass from Noemi DeCorey, but unfortunately due to technical difficulties, there's no video of the goal. So here's video of Noemi DeCorey passing to Brie Asbury in another game, and let's just pretend that this shot went in instead of being blocked. And let's pretend that the Mules celebrated like this. At number two, volleyball against Merchant Marine, down two sets to none, tied 24-24 in the third set, but the Mules take the set on back-to-back -back kills by sophomore Rachel Jacobs and sophomore Esme Oler. The Mules go on to win the fourth and fifth sets, 25-10 and 15-5 to complete the incredible comeback. And at number one, the men's soccer team hadn't scored a first half goal all season, but senior Chris Richards heads in this cross from senior Ty Actag, just 739 in against William Patterson. The Mules go on to win 4 to nothing, and that's our number one play of the week. A reminder, you can nominate plays for plays of the week at MuhlenbergSports.com slash nominate plays. Back with more plays next week. Go Mules!